Hello. 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 Today we are going to talk about the Japanese spirit, shochu. Shochu, like sake, is a traditional Japanese alcoholic beverage. However, while sake is produced by fermentation, shochu is a distilled liquor. Shochu types are classified by its ingredients, production methods, and place of origin. For example, shochu made in Okinawa, the southernmost island of the Japanese archipelago, is called, awamori. What comes up in your mind when you think of distilled spirits? Bourbon. Tequila. Rum. Gin. Whiskey. Cognac. Don't forget Japan also has shochu, one of the world's most celebrated spirits with a 500-year history. One of the unique features of shochu is that it can be made from a variety of ingredients. Sweet potato, barley, rice, brown sugar, buckwheat, sesame, and various other ingredients can be used to make shochu. Each of these ingredients have their own distinctive flavor, which adds to the fun of trying them all. Fun, fun and, and exciting. exciting! There are also rare and premium vintage products that have been aged in bottles, jars, and barrels. In Okinawa, there's a tradition to seal, awamori, in a jar when a child is born, then let it mature until the child turns 20, unseal and drink it at a family celebration. Nice! I can appreciate aged, awamori, is a treasured Japanese tradition that shows the passage of time within family history. The alcohol content of shochu ranges from 25% to 60%. So it's much higher than sake. Most commonly, shochu in Japan is 25%. It's generally mixed with water or hot water, and enjoyed with meals. With no sugar content, it's also popular as the healthier choice for alcoholic beverage. Japanese shochu has not quite taken off in the world yet. You can gain an advantage by learning about shochu before it gets popular. Yes! yes.